to a Stroop here Bike Man performance. Today we're going to try to ultrasonically clean a uh, take apart turbo, uh, one that we're rebuilding, and we're going to see how good the ultrasonic cleaner works on it. And we haven't done this before, but uh, we do have an ultrasonic cleaner that we use for other things, and it's just a video showing uh, if it works or if it doesn't work on the turbo. This particular turbo is for a Polaris XP turbo side by side. Alright, Farmer, what's the verdict? How did uh, the ultrasonic cleaning work? Did alright on the uh, lightly soiled stuff, but anywhere where there's heavy carbon deposits, it didn't really do anything. So on the turbo where it was all coked up from the oil, what does that look like? Not real good. Still about the same result. Heavy carbon deposited in the oil galleys, so we're going to have to get out the pick or try something new. What about the uh, lighter weight uh, metals like the center hub, hub bushing and center hub bushing. It actually cleaned a little bit on the exterior, but down in the oil galleys, they're still full of carbon. The results are uh, not hope, not exactly what we're hoping for, but it did a little bit of work. How about on the turbine shaft? Turbine shaft, about the same. Still heavy uh, carbon deposits all on the turbine. So maybe we could say on the on the softer metals it does more than on the heavier metals? Yeah, I'd say we could make that assumption out of this. And it did clean some off the exterior bearing or the uh, outer bearing uh, support. All right, so let's, uh, for reference, let's go look at some, some new parts. What Sweet. the rebuilding parts let's look like. All right, so explain to me what components go in when we rebuild a turbo. All right, when we're rebuilding a turbo, this is the outer bearing support, and this is your outer bearing. This sits in the compressor housing interior plate. There's an oil seal that goes on here. This little guy, it's not a conventional oil seal. It's more like a snap, or more like a piston ring. So it's, it's just a compression style seal, and it seals inside. This housing, this is actually one that's installed right now. That supports the end of the turbine shaft. From there, we put in, this is a new snap ring that holds this bushing in. This is a new bushing for the turbine shaft. Uh, you get new O-ring that goes underneath the housing. It sits and in here. I believe we also have one for the outside for the yep, we have compressor housing as well. Housing. And then you get a new turbine oil seal as well. You get a new turbine oil seal as well. This one goes on the back side, on the exhaust side of the turbine. Awesome. Well, that's uh, us rebuilding a turbo. We're seeing if we could clean it, but it looks like we're going to put some new components in.